So, cystoid macular edema, it is a condition where there can be cystic spaces in the retina. after any systemic or ocular condition. Now many causes of CME can be there. As I told you when I talked about in the diabetic retinopathy, we can have diabetic retinopathy as a common cause. We can this have after intraocular surgery as well because any intraocular surgery can cause inflammation. Even some drugs can cause the cystoid macular edema. Remember it with the mnemonic NEAT PG that is nicotine or niacin ee goes with the epinephrine t goes with the tamoxifen and pg goes with the pg analogs also conditions like retinitis pigmentosa or even in intraocular tumors we can have cystoid macular edema if you can see this is a OCT picture where you can see the cystic spaces are there in the inner layers of retina. Okay. Now very important is whenever you see a cystoid macular edema, it can really cause diminution of vision. So you can start this patient on anti-inflammatory drugs like topical NSAIDs, example is Napavinac and you can also then if the patient is not resolving with the topical NSAIDs, you can give intravitreal steroids like I told you Ozrodex. and anti vegifs like ranibizumab, bevacizumab and broclozumab. So this is very important to remember the conditions which can cause the cystoid macular edema. So most importantly the drugs that can cause macular edema because this was the last year's question.